Hey boys and girls, today we are learning about part part whole number stories. They're also known as parts and total number stories. Now here's our example. There were four pots of purple flowers and two pots of yellow flowers on a porch. How many pots of flowers were there all together? Now in a part part total number story, or a part part whole, we have two numbers. Those are our parts that we put together or subtract. And in this situation, we want to find out how much there is all together, meaning we're going to be adding. We knew that there are four purple flowers, four, two yellow flowers, two. And do we know the answer yet? We don't. So we'll put a question mark inside of the box. Now let's try one on our own. Let's see how we do. Here is a parts and total diagram. Sometimes the word whole will be right here. But that's okay, it's the exact same thing, just worded a little differently. What I want to find out today is how many dots we have on this domino, in all. Well, it looks like we have two numbers. On one side, we have seven. On the other side, we have eight. And do we know, does it tell us immediately how many we have total? It doesn't, so we will put a question mark. Then let's write a number model. We'll start with our parts. Seven plus eight equals question mark, because we don't have a total yet. Then down here, we are going to write the answer of how many dots we have. If we count up all of those dots or know seven plus eight, we know the answer is 15. Now let's try this with a number story. We're going to use the UPS check method so we can go along with it. All right, so first we need to you understand, read the problem, and find out what facts I know or don't know. Ava read 12 fiction books and 10 nonfiction books. How many books has she read? Well, I know that we want to find out how many books she has read. So that must mean we're going to have to add or put together how many books she's read so far. She's read 12 fiction and she's read 10 nonfiction. So we can start filling out our parts in total diagram. One part would be 12 fiction. The other part would be 10 nonfiction. And did they tell us a total number? No, that's what we're searching for. That's our unknown. So let's come up with a number model. 12 fiction books plus 10 non-fiction books will tell us how many books she's read in all, which for now is a question mark. So now it's your job. 12 plus 10. Well, I know that in the ones place, 0 and 2 is 2, and in the tens place, two plus two, 1 plus 1 is 2. So she has read a total of 22 books. Now, if you can't do that in your head, which is perfectly fine, although we should all be able to add 10, you could do stack and add. Just like that, okay? Let's try another story problem with part, part, whole. A banana cost 10 cents. A water costs 25 cents. What is the total cost? Well, we need to you understand it. They want to know the total cost, so I'm guessing that they're going to want us to add together. Well, we know 10 cents for a banana and 25 cents for water. So let's start filling out our plan. 10 cents here. 25 cents here. And they want to know the total cost, so we aren't given our total yet, so we write a question mark. So down here in our number model, we'll go 10 cents plus 25 cents. And do we have a total yet? Equals, we don't, so we're going to put a question mark. Then our answer will go down here, 10 plus 25. I know 10 more than 25, because we're solving it, is 35. And don't forget to put the sense, oops, the sense sign. If you want to double check your work, you could stack and add off to the side. Just like this. 
Let's keep going. A hot dog cost 45 cents. An orange cost 25 cents. What is the total cost? Hmm, this is very similar. We're gonna do our UPS check. We know they wanna know the total cost, so we're adding again. A hot dog is 45 cents and an orange is 25. So we're gonna do 45 cents plus 25 cents. Do we know the total yet? We don't, so we're gonna put a question mark. Now let's do our number model. 45 cents plus 20, oops, 25 cents equals question mark. Now if this one's a little harder, we would do a stack and add. 45 plus 25 to help us solve it. 5 plus 5 is 10. I carry the 1. 1 plus 4 is 5. Plus 6, 7. 70. So my answer would be 70 cents.